just about dark and I'm just amazed at that. look at this <laughs> Jesus <laughs> is this unreal or what a cow walking across the road three cows there's two more on the other side there man and if you hit a cow here and it ruins your car you have to pay for the cow you just hurt and all the cows that they think it might have had in its lifetime It's like right here, it comes a bike. Look at that bike right there. No lights on at all. We just passed a car. I took, took the camera out because we just passed a car at a market parked right in the center of the lane on the national highway and shopping in the market. Unless it was broke down there, but I can't believe that. with no lights on another bike coming with no lights on and a bicycle look at that unbelievable people walking with their backs to the traffic another bike coming with no lights on right there this guy's got a tail light you can see for about 20 feet Lucky this car has pretty good headlights on it. Real nice bright lights. <laughs> People out walking around. Two bikes in a row with no lights on. And they know that they can get away with it because the police don't come out after about 4.30. They don't have any checkpoints that lets us some kind of an emergency or a wanted thing or something like that. Like a manhunt. Checkpoint completely deserted. What is it, about 545, 550 right now? You might guess. Just about dark. You can see another bike. Here comes another bike. Two bikes side by side, no lights on. <laughs> I can hardly see in this light here. If there's lights coming at me, I'm just about blind. Like right there, it's smoky right here. Lights coming at you. hope there's nothing in right in front of you. Half the people walking around are wearing masks. See, I couldn't see anything there for about five seconds. Man, a lot of people walking around here. Haven't seen a mask in this town yet. are on though. It's pretty nice. Now two years ago there wasn't a street light on the island. But all of a sudden they must they got a bunch of grants for something. Because they're everywhere now. It used to be so nice driving on the roads when they were dark. Some places have the little they look like the reflectors on the yellow line or the white line. 
but they're actually little solar lights. We passed a bunch a while back. There aren't any on this road until we get to Hitafi, the next town. There's some some of those lights, but they're kind of annoying too because they're it almost if you're tired and you start seeing them out of the side of your eye, it's almost like you're in a tunnel or something. It's very distracting, like a like a video game or something like that. Two kids walking, no masks, bicycle. Another bike with no light. A lot of times you'll see a light bobbing up and down and it'll be a motorcycle with a, a light on a headlamp. parked on both sides of the road this truck here halfway out on the on the road halfway on the shoulder another big truck it's supposed to be zero parking on a national highway and a bus I wonder what this is all about why is there so many vehicles here they can't all be broke down there's no log books or nothing like that here in the Philippines for the drivers they drive as much as they want Could be log books, but I've never heard of it. Another bike with no lights. Street lights here, don't they? It's been about five kilometers. Look how many millions that cost. Those are all solar lights too. Solar LEDs. Vista to Hatafi, that little dip back there. There's some Christmas lights. First ones of the season. Somebody walking or a bicycle, I can't tell you. Bicycle. driving for you guys I gotta pay attention a little closer thanks for riding along I'll talk to you later I'll talk to you later bye bye God bless everyone see you again in <laughs> they can't see anyway on it's dark in here